right, how's it going guys? Welcome back to the channel. Yes, as you can see, there is a bit difference in the background and it's looking beautiful today. It's because I'm in London, obviously, as you've read the title. I'm here for two days. I came here on yesterday, I came on a Friday. We are basically uh, walking through the London city. I don't know which place is this, by the way. South well, South Kensington, the answer given by Val. So, this is one of my friends who lives in London. Yes, he lives in London. He's living the dreaming life. And, <laughs> but he's not happy with that. I don't know why he's crazy. And yeah, you get to see all this daily because he works here. He's not a student. Because of him, I had the chance to come here. So for two days, we're gonna explore the London. We're gonna cover some places and I'm gonna bring you as much as visuals as I can because this was one of my ultimate vlogs, which I've been planning from years i don't even know when i started planning on it because i kept seeing all this uh videos on youtube obviously and i had to make one for myself and i'm gonna do best as i can yeah let's get going so i just wanted to show you guys where i'm crashing for these two days so basically i was you know staying with bal so he got a apartment a studio apartment here right in south kensington as i told you uh, this is the apartment and i'll just quickly give you a tour so yeah this is a one bedroom flat and there's a toilet down there so he just went to the toilet so it's a change so this is the morning right now before you guys see the intro so we just woke up and we are actually making plans so this is basically i am recording before i actually went out so this is before I need to kick start the morning right now so i just woke up and uh, that's him and i have to drink the coffee now so you know to get a little bit kick start So we'll get ready to explore London, baby. Yeah, we can come back. Yeah, but Q and all.
I'm in the Hyde Park now and right behind me is the Albert's Memorial which is Queen Victoria and she used to rule all over the places. She was actually obsessed with her husband. She built this monument just for her husband, you know, sit in that middle. And yeah, it's, I don't know if it's actual gold. I'll just figure it out later. I don't have the time to search now, but yeah, I think it's gold. She was in crazy love with them. And yeah, that's in Hyde Park. And this is a huge park, like even it's even more beautiful than the Central Park. That's what he told me because yeah, it looks kind of different than the parks I've been to before. Yep, that's the Alps Memorial. Where is this now? Oxford Street. Yeah. But if I had the I think if we get a 74, we can go to the storm up south. Officially the first meal of the day I think yeah because we didn't eat anything in the morning I just had that coffee so we came into a Mexican restaurant which is called Oaxaca so he recommended me this one and I don't know what the taste gonna be like um, I'm gonna try it for the first time a quesadilla so I'm waiting for that we just ordered let's see tasted it before so you know your kids I like it uh, fingers crossed let's say because the menu is not cheap but not like the expensive one let's say it's London so the food is gonna be expensive well here comes our quesadilla so 
on a tortilla filled with chicken and avocado. There was one more piece, I just already had it and it was actually good. No surprise because obviously he recommended me this thing and I came and had this which I liked it. I know this taste actually, you know, for this alfam chicken or the, yeah, basically alfam chicken. It's a similar taste with avocado, which is actually wrapped on a tortilla. So that's the difference. It's got the same taste, but even more tastier than that. And I liked it. I like it. How's it? I really like quesadillas, it's my favorite. So. It wasn't a bad decision. It's worth it. I mean, not at the like super expensive stuff, but they work. You need to get this for selfish. Okay, so it's almost um, 6 59 and uh, it's not almost, almost 7 o'clock. And we came back to the place because we had like so many stuff that we bought, like did some shopping and uh, we had to bring it back to the room because we can't just carry it all the day along with us so it's almost gonna be night but the daylight is still there and it is actually getting a little bit cold so we had to change into a thick clothes so i'll wear my hoodie then so yeah now we're gonna go back to see rest of the laptop so we're gonna go to westminster now so we're gonna go through the tube so which i haven't shown you yet so we're gonna take the tube to westminster We are now waiting for the train to come. So, yeah, I think it's just here now. Yep, there we go. Right, we arrived at Westminster. No, 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 sorry. It's not Westminster, we're next to Tower Bridge. Uh, Bridge. Yep. And it is actually getting cold now. It was supposed to be heat wave. Tell me about the features of the heat wave here. <laughs> it rains. <laughs> it and rains it and cold wind. Oh, it's kind of a special heat wave. It's a little bit it's of a drizzle. Heat wave of 16 degrees Celsius. Yes, exactly. <laughs> So that was something of a different one and we're confused that it, if it's gonna snow tomorrow even if it's a heat wave so that's the London weather especially you can't predict it all of the others were like at least okay you can expect this is what's gonna happen but here was like sunshine rain heat again sunshine again rain when we were going to the house it was actually raining now it stopped but it's cold now yeah well Let's go to Tower Bridge now. <sighs> oh, lavender blooms for the queen. So, yeah, as you can see, 
right on the background that's our tower bridge the main attraction i mean one of the main attraction in the london of course and not just the tower bridge there is big ben as well you're gonna see that in a minute but before that you have to cover this one because this is the best views Right, this is the exact um, the photo bombing area. Like everyone has to take a picture from here, right? Everyone has to take a picture from here. That's the cliche. Like everyone who comes here, actually coming here to get a photo. So obviously, we are gonna take our photo as well. So yeah, we've photobombed enough from the tower bridge. So we're moving from that point to where we are going to start walking on the bridge. Yeah, we are going to actually walk into the tower bridge. Well, all of my dreams are coming true. Well, I mean, I kept saying this, but I can't stop saying this. So that's why, don't mind me. Um, that, yeah, let's get going. technically in the middle of the bridge it's actually a little bit farther but it's a bit busy there so that's why we thought we'll sit here oh we're going south the river <laughs> yeah basically reason being that people in the south is not very nice like the people no, in north don't say that don't it's, say that. I'm not saying that, no offense, but that's how they say. And and there is a saying like the north people does like the south people. Basically, south of the river, north of the river. And that, that's how they say like I live in the north and south. So that's kind of a different. So basically crossing into the south. You get a lot of page comments from the people living in south. <laughs> Again I say no offense for the people in the south I made it clear <laughs> yeah basically the north people have like a more attitude north of the river I'm speaking as a Vamala citizen of this north side <laughs> It's technically 8 in the night and still there is daylight. Obviously, as I've told you before, it's because it's summer. And yeah, we are now in the south of the river, walking through the riverside of River Thames. <coughs> you can see background. That thing there. I don't even know what to say actually. I just want to show you guys the places. That's it. That's why I'm not speaking much. Yeah, and almost 
course it's getting late. I don't know what's the time now. Let me check. It's uh, 9.17. Going to night and we are in Westminster now. So that's the London Eye and